Oh, she's stabbing herself again, so we're gonna fast forward it a little. Hey guys, it's JJ Simmer, and welcome to part 5 of The Sims 4 Vampires. And I've been waiting for this part for about 4 parts, if that makes any sense. So, if you don't know, a while ago I did a I did a mod review on the Sorcerer's mod, and I've been wanting to play with it ever since, but I don't really play with supernatural people on my everyday gameplay. Actually, that's kind of a lie, because all my sims are vampires, but that's just because my sim fell in love with the vampire. I have no vampires in my house, so I have a vampire toddler, but they don't really do anything. That is beside the point. I had this Sorcerer mod, and I was wanting to use it for a while now, but I just haven't gotten to it, and I was like, you know what? Vampires and Sorcerers, that's kind of like a fun thing for this LP. So I definitely think like sorcerers will have like a not huge but a part of this let's play just to like keep it interesting so we are in the house of a sorcerer and the vampire this is technically a vampire household and ha has Lilith Vator 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 I don't know and Kayla Vator who my sim is actually dating and had to that's where the toddler baby came from but and then Hermione Gardener who is the sorcerer and you can see she's a sorcerer but she has all these magical things and whatever and you, I don't know if you, I assume that you guys saw a few parts ago that we, Hermione and Bella met up and they, they're not on the best of terms. I think Bella tried to drink from her, I'm not 100% sure, and then Bella and Vlad tried to get these guys into their club, but they did not, so they're kind of like enemies, like, I'll show you how, so, like, Bella well first off let's show you Bella why did I just say Bella oh that's because that's her enemy's name they're not enemies yet but this sim is crazy like she has the same traits insane on, outgoing evil and then this is like her um sorcerer's thing where it's never bed header so she, yeah it do that doesn't matter if you guys want to learn more about the sorcerer's mod definitely go check out my sorcerer mod review which I don't know I might have linked below who knows but this sim has the thing what's it called the thing also the trait dastery which like honestly I've never heard of but anyways we're gonna turn that off because that's a bit annoying but sorcerers have the option to have their little magical like what are they called magical energy just going around but we are not gonna do that. And now, honestly, I definitely don't know enough about the sorcerer's mod to be doing like having a sorcerer in my let's play. But we are gonna try for this. And just give me three seconds because I need to start my timer. Ooh, guys, it's Bella's mom. Now, as you can see, like this is kind of like their secret room, but they all know about this room. But like the Vlator siblings never come up here. This is really. Hermione's room. Sorry, I totally got tugged tied there. And as you can see, Hermione has like a burn book type thing. I don't know. She just has pictures of Vlad and Bella. And those are just like hit pictures. Like, she definitely wants to make their life a living hell. Ah, uh, what, what's happening? And I definitely just think that she's going to like practice her spells right now just to like work on that. Teleport here. Teleport. Yeah, we're going to teleport her here. Ooh, super cool, right? And we're just gonna, I don't know. I should really know this mod a little better, right? I'm sorry. Well, we'll just test a few spells on Lilith, how about? Because that's a thing, right? Spells, black, ooh, renew. Uh. Well, we could do black arts, enchant to kneel. That's interesting. Because she just like, she's just insane. Ooh. This is like a screenshot moment. Can I just state? And like, I feel like the good thing about sorcerers too is that they do not like, what's it called? Burn in the sunlight. So let's hope she doesn't die, right? Oh, and I think I forgot to add. I think that she, oh yeah, she is dating Caleb. If so, that's like weird piece. Like vampires and sorcerers, like mating. <laughs> it's weird. Guys, this is kind of weird for me to record because I never have like, there's a huge story around this and I usually don't have stories so it's just weird for me. But anyways, we're going to make these two talk to each other because definitely like in this let's play, I definitely want to explore their relationship a bit because like, I don't know, what are Caleb's traits? Let's check those out first. I don't think he's like a bad vampire. 
is he? Let's check his traits and then we'll see Lilith's traits. He's materialistic, <laughs> ambitious, so and full of booty, <laughs> which is weird because he doesn't have a job. But his aspiration is to be a good vampire. So yeah, he's good, which is weird why he's like so into her. But I feel like she definitely has him under a spell, quote unquote. And she still days, but she wants a vampire family, which I don't even think she has any offspring. So that's a little bit weird. But she has the trait... Mm, that's not trait. She has the traits creative, active, outgoing, and domestic. So, those vampires honestly have weird traits, but they're definitely kind of like good vampires in that sense. Like, they're all good, but she is bad at the bone. Like, she has aspiration, public enemy. So, like, she's not looking to make friends. <laughs> um, but let's see. Honestly, I kind of wish that I went and tested out this mod because I kind of forget how it works but i do know the pure magic return nope. magic to object no that's not what i want to do mm, what do i want to do you know what i know what i want to do what i wanted to do i wanted her to go visit the cure family because i feel like she would definitely have like a relationship with them because they're all like she's evil and the cure family's evil and i feel like they know each other in a weird way okay guys well we are at their house and i don't definitely forgot to add that like she actually has a pretty good relationship with like the cure family like her and Jaden are true friends and then her and lydia are just friends but they still have a pretty good relationship so like i just feel like they their personality types are just very similar so i think that she's friends with the whole family and obviously you guys can probably tell i added these active friendship levels but that's just because i forgot to add them before and it works with the storyline so she has a relationship with the kids but we will not get to explore that until they come so i can be home so i can cheat their friendship but she's just gonna go upstairs and kind of like talk to them because yeah i just i don't know it just works with the story um she's gonna discuss local 50s fishing spot because i almost just feel like i'm not quite sure if this is true but like i feel like they're family friends and this might be a hint for future storylines because like i don't know i just think she thinks of these two as like a parental figures but obviously she's much closer to Jaden than olivia so that's interesting so she's just gonna be like she'll just chat with them really and like if she especially likes Jaden because like I think she's probably a little mad at Lydia for like because she can like see that Lydia joined this vampire club so maybe she'll like talk about that you clubs no I don't think that's really what I wanted to do <laughs> she's going to see guys this like this part is kind of T talk about vampires yeah they're gonna talk about it but this part's kind of weird for me to film since there's such a story around it like it's not just like we're hanging out with Bella like there's a huge story about it ooh Hermione's outgoing um yeah so like she's not hard to get along with she's just insane <laughs> so you probably don't want to get along with her and she's just gonna be like what the hell Lydia like how could you like join that club and well, she, I think she's actually probably just trying to get some info on the club is there any other convinced to leave mm, we could try I feel like she definitely would try to convince her honestly for storyline purposes I hope that she doesn't leave but we'll try to convince her oh he's just hypnotizing her now that's a little rude but it says I'll read this. Madam Vlad Strude, I don't even know if that's last name, is doing a great job with the vampires. I hope they stick around for a long time. That's kind of rude. But I think, like, I don't know. She's just going to wreak havoc over the streak. Street. So let's teleport here. Oh. No, we'll teleport her here. I don't know, guys. Honestly, I think there was, like, a little bit of a shift in this mod, if I'm being honest. Ooh. A mortal sim. Why do mortal sims keep on coming here? Like, don't they know what's gonna happen? We're because renew magical connection. We're gonna drain her need. We're gonna drain her. What's a need that we need? She kind of needs hunger. Can you drain hunger? I don't think you can. Um, spell. Ooh, drain. Drain hunger. That doesn't drain my hunger, does it? If I'm draining somebody else's, I think it doesn't. So let's hope because I don't want her to starve. But I think like right now she's just trying to like get back in her roots so she can be strong enough to like fight Vlad, you know? 
because like she knows about this vampire army and she definitely needs to like oh she has like a grim reaper thing she definitely needs to go back on that oh what's happening here why are they so far apart she's like chanting guys oh it's because i upload i updated this this is why i'm not so good at it but we'll definitely play with her again soon and i will definitely know how to do more sorcerer things so it's funner because that's definitely a word oh that's a little psychotic she's like po i'm like amazed by this mod like honestly and i definitely like this just gave me so much more excited like ugh. and this isn't even like the recently updated version which why maybe why we're having some issues that was a little psycho though what's she doing now Ooh, I don't know what the point of that is. They're really losing this like for each other. But I think she's okay with this. And it, wait, let's see what it says. Bonded. Hermione's essence is linked to another Sims. To end the transfer progress early, use sever bond. No, we're going to drain her need. Look at all of this. This is such a cute interaction. Well, cute might not be the right word. It's like a psycho interaction. And look how crazy she looks. And I don't know how long this is going to take, but we're just going to watch like we're fans. And she's just, oh, sorry. What did I just do? Hermione. No, but I was trying to show you, like, look at Nina. Nina is just, like, there. Like, not even. Let's just look at her face. She's just, like, whatever. Okay, master. And Hermione's, like, having all these flirty moodlets. I'm interested in the moodlets. Let's see what these say. <laughs> From be in well, I don't even know what that says. It'll Antico Whirly. The voices are talking in the language of love. <laughs> uh made a new good friend. Oh, that's from be cheating their stuff. Whatever. Whatever. It's fine. Oh, she's stabbing herself again. I don't know what that's doing. That's probably like a connection thing. Oh dude, this like looks hurt. This looks like it hurts. He's like, What are you doing? You're insane. How many times does she need to stab herself? Just out of curiosity. I kind of love it. I guess I could have fast forwarded through it, but I'm kind of loving watching it and commenting through it. I'm sorry if this is like, you're like, what happens? But I'm so interested. And I think if I fast forward it through it, like we missed something and I don't want to miss anything. I think it's almost done too. Oh, she's stabbing herself one more time. See, she goes so far back that time. Okay, let's just look. Is this moving? I just want her to like drain her hunger. Yeah, we'll move. Oh, she's still doing this. Do I need like... Okay, what does that mean? What's happening now? And as you can see, this is a skill. Like I'm sure, I don't think you can see it. It's not like one of, it's probably like a hidden skill. I would assume, right? Oh no, Black Arts is not hidden. She's proud, and it says, what does it say now that she's a level 2 black art skill? Hermione can now cast, set fire on the ground, and siphon joy into wealth on sim on a sim who is happy. I thought she could do that before, but apparently not. Speaking of this, this gives me an idea now that she can set fire to the ground. Ideas, guys. Okay, how long is this going to take? Is this ever going to end? Like, we're just trying to drain her energy. Like, it was cute at first, but I just want to drain her energy. Like, please. If this isn't ending, like, three seconds, we're just going to exit. Because her hunger still isn't drained, and I don't think... Can we not delete this? Oh, okay. It said to end this, we're just going to have to sever links. Sever links. So we're going to sever a link to her. She's probably like dying here. Oh, she really doesn't like us. Look at this. Look at that. Well, it looks like she's hungry. So that's good. Right? Come on. Can I delete this now? We're gonna like, I don't know. I felt like I didn't get enough of a reaction. So we're actually gonna, you know what? No, we're gonna find someone else. What's fine? Ooh, who are you? I think this is Caleb actually. Ugh, sorry, that probably made you dizzy. No, I don't like I don't like his hat with that outfit. It doesn't go. So we're gonna reduce. We're gonna drain need. We're gonna drain bladder. And let's hope that this like turns out a little faster because 
I don't need to be sitting here for another 10 minutes commentating her poking herself. Ooh. Where did he go? I didn't get to see him pee himself. This is what happens when we fast forward. We're gonna do it one more time. We're gonna do it. Ooh. Perfect. We're gonna go do it to her. And let's just keep in mind. Okay, you don't know this, but this is Bella's mom. Right? Yeah. This is Bella's mom. But she doesn't know this is Bella's mom, which just makes it perfect. She's just doing an evil thing. So she's gonna drain bladder. Peace. We did not get to see that. Let's go. Where are you? Hermione. Hermione. It's so funny that her name's Hermione. She's like evil piece. Hermione, who I named her after, who obviously is Hermione from Harry Potter, is, is anything but evil. But hey, it's okay. Okay. Well, we're obviously going to follow her. She's going to do that grim thing again. Which, can we take a screenshot? Because that is just like, she just looks badass. She has like Grimm's little whip. I'm loving it. Um, screenshot. She has something in her hand that I don't know what it is, but it's fine. Okay, now she's just on her knees, which is great. Oh, she's stabbing herself again, so we're gonna fast forward it a little. Just till it's done, because we obviously just wanna see. Maybe we'll look at her this time, because each time we've been looking at like Hermione doing the spells but why not see what happens to the victims she has this little I don't know enchant thing going on where are these two at home oh right we traveled away from home <laughs> I totally forgot about that uh but oh you guys at work look she has this now she really is guppy okay Hermione can now suppress sadness on herself <laughs> please somebody give me that She's gonna like pee herself. Is she? Ooh, girl. <laughs> Look what we did. We're so evil. Like, I mean, don't be evil, guys, but like, we all have to think that's badass. But, you guys, you know, now that she can, let's try setting fire. Because it said that we can do it. Fire can only be started with the build mode outline of the active lot. What does that mean? Oh, we can probably like set fire here, right? Right? Yeah. Okay, guys. Well, obviously we we like the cures. We don't need to set fire in their lots, so we're just gonna hang out with them for a while, and then we're gonna go to our enemy's house and set fire on it because why else would we need this need? But okay, guys, I'm just gonna like cheat the, their relationship now because these two are actually best friends, and I just wanted like that to be shown like they're childhood friends and I just like I was going to do it kind of like secretive but that was kind of like what the hell like these two are best friends are you serious we're gonna wake her up that's how close we are like we gotta talk to our bestie gossip about neighbors is she in the club I feel like she'd be super hurt if her best friend was in this club she is so she's definitely gonna be like a little rude to her she'll be like yell at yeah, she'll definitely just give her a little yell and be like, how could you go on into that club? Like, don't you even care about, like, my feelings or something like that? Not that I feel like Hermione, like, has feelings, but I definitely think she'd say something like that because she's malignant. She's manipulative. And she's going to talk about the club. Ooh, phone. Shut. Sh shush. What was that? Oh, it's just a snap. And she's like, I don't have time for these two to be hugging. And she just like she just knows of him like they're not friends obviously like she, I feel like she's just so hurt and she's gonna ask what club and then she's gonna insult and she's gonna be like how dare you I feel like she would like is there any spells that she could do that would just be kind of like rude for a minute um renew magical connection oh Okay, so you can't do that on, what's it called, vampires, which, like, lucky her. And you guys, look, our alignment is, like, in the negatives, which means we're very evil. <laughs> See, I feel like she'd just not be impressed by any of this. And, you know, I feel like he's kind of getting on my nerves. Like, we're going to lull him to sleep, too. Black magic, lull to sleep. Oh, we can do some, we can do some magical connections on him because he is not 
a vampire technically i don't know if he's growing up into one he has two parents who are vampires i don't know how that sh shenanigan works okay is she lulling him to sleep oh yeah and she's just gonna go talk to her mom and be like can you believe your daughter did that like share a secret and gossip she's gonna be like can you believe she did that to me because i feel like at the end of the day she, oh right she's in the club just kidding she's not gonna talk to her she's gonna talk to where is um what's their face their dad is he just gone no he's swimming in this this is like the tiniest swim i've ever made but i think it looks good i she's gonna be like thank you so give him a heartfelt compliment and just be like thank you so much for not joining that club and then she's gonna just share a secret and be like i'm actually super hurt about them joining that club because that was rude i would be ticked like you can't blame her for being ticked right i feel like you can't blame her okay so she's gonna do that soon and then after that she's gonna go to vladimir's house is it vladimir i always call him vladimir it's so weird sorry for any of you who have that name because you're probably like it's dove his name's not vladimir you smell vladimir like this but she's gonna go to his house i don't even know what that means teleport yeah we're just gonna visit no i just said move household from the gallery right Ugh. be prepared for the loading screens that was actually pretty fast for the gallery i'm sorry i hate how that's like a new option when did that become a thing visit just visit alone come on she's just gonna visit alone and like there she is good to see that she cleaned herself up right <laughs> maybe she's looking for bella i'm not sure guys i'm honestly not sure come on come on come on, come on. run Oh, they're all just kind of having this mini pool party. That's fun. Oh, we're already leaving. Okay, you guys, we are at Vlad's house. And we all know why we are here. We're here for one reason. And I love that his house is already open. We are here to set on fire. Now, I don't think it will set this whole house on fire. Let's hope not, because we actually live in this house. But I feel like she would definitely just do that. And she'd be like, where are Vlad and Bella? Let's see if we can find them. I don't think like that's like that big of a fire. Uh, are they just both gone? Because that's strange, right? Am I the only one who finds that strange? Uh, whatever. She'll set like different portions of their house on fire, though. I feel like she's like that rude. She's like she's out for blood, guys. Sh like she's insane. She goes to their house when they're seemingly not there. I don't know. I see a bad as that blood. <laughs> no, I don't see him. Why does he need two of these little nooks? Like, that's just creepy. And he has his fun little basement. Ooh. Did I set that third part? Can we just set his piano on fire? Vlad discovered the fire. A fire has started. Maybe Sims should look. I don't know where Vlad is, but he apparently knows about this fire. Oh, there he is. We set fire on Vlad's house. Uh, Barza, Barza, and he's like, what do I do? Barza. Maybe try to extinguish it. And then we're going to set one more fire piece. We're like, we're evil. We're going to set a fire in like his bedroom just because we're that bad. Oh, you guys. No. <laughs> Vlad is here. She's like, crap. Well, it, well, actually, I did hear her say that. And she's going to be like, "Can we? do we have any... We'll just lull him to sleep. Because then it's like, then Vlad can't do anything. Right? Lull to sleep. Go, go. You got this. He's lulled to sleep, guys. She is evil. And she's really gonna... She's gonna be an issue, guys. If, if that worked. Why is Vlad not asleep? Is this gonna work? I don't think it's gonna work because he's freaking cheering. Come on, let's try one more time. Vlad. Let's go sleep, Vlad. Um, near misery. Oh, there we go. Vlad. Okay, we'll do it one more time. <laughs> because obviously it's not working. A lot of the sleep. I don't know why it's not working. Come on. Maybe this time it'll work. It worked in all the other sims. Come on. Has she lost her touch? Maybe they can't lull someone to sleep while there's like a fire in the house. I guess. Like, 
I guess I'm fine with this. Look. Oh, somehow the fire has all spread to this area. But guys, we set fire to Vlad's house. Like, she got a revenge. And this sim is going to be one tricky sim to handle in the future. Like, I think we all know. She, this is not the last time we'll be in this household. And this is a, not the last time, like, she'll pop up. Like, she's going to have a prevalent part in this. So, be prepared for that. And I had really fun this part. And I cannot wait to play in her household again. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed this part. And don't forget to comment, like, or subscribe, and I will see you all in the next part. So, bye guys.